Okay, second grade. Today I'm going to show you how to switch people using Google Chrome so that you can log in and stay logged in and not accidentally use your brother's account for something like Typing Club or Khan Academy. So first of all, if you've been using Firefox and you've seen this whole list of usernames and you're switching between them, stop doing that. Talk to your parents about getting Google Chrome browser and then you can come up here to the top Right now I'm pointing at my name. Yours might just say person one. Click it and then click switch person. Add a person. And then type in your login information. We'll log in as Gracie W. Okay, and now Gracie's logged in, so she can do a few different things. Now, one thing she can do is she can come up here and pick a picture so she can tell who she is. Let's make her this Daisy right here. That one looks nice. You can change your name if you'd like. And then she can start using all of the tools that she normally uses and won't have to log in for everything. I'll show you how quick you can switch between each other. So she can go to Typing Club, for example, click Login, Login using Google. And there we go, she's logged in. It says, Hi Gracie, it's keeping track of all of her levels that she's beat. And then down here at the bottom, you can see I have some different icons made. We could switch to another person. I'm now switched to Naya who's passed a bunch of levels too, I can switch back to myself. You can switch to your mom or dad. They can check their email without having to log out of, log out of your emails. So give that a try and let me know how it works.